My name is Christine Winkler, and I've been dancing with Atlanta Ballet for 19 seasons. There's been a lot of huge moments here at Atlanta Ballet for me. I mean, when I joined the company, I was 21 years old, and I had never danced, you know, a principal role in a story ballet. I think my first story ballet was Cinderella, Ben Stevenson's Cinderella, and that was my first season with the company, and it was just, you know, you, you dream of having a, having a, this starring role in a ballet, and, and that was my first one. And I mean, I learned so much in that first season about myself, about dancing, about character roles on stage, and it was just, it was, that was a really special moment for me. And, and also that ballet is kind of special as well because later on we performed it again, and I got to dance with John, my, my husband, John Welker, and uh, it was right before we got married. So we got married on stage, and then two weeks later we got married here in Atlanta in the gardens. I remember the first program we did was Peter Martin's Ash, uh, David Allen's Pastoral Dances, and Danny Ezerlo's uh, Read My Hips. And we danced everything in that program, and we died. <laughs> and it was just kind of a taste of, this is Atlanta Ballet, this is, this is where we're going, this is how physical it's gonna be, and this is what we're gonna be doing. And I think that first season actually set the bar, you know, for, for how we were gonna work and how John McFall was gonna bring great things to Atlanta. Working with the Indigo Girls was, that was such a thrill. I mean, it was part ballet, but mostly rock concert. <laughs> and same thing with uh, Big Boy, you know, it was just such an unusual experience. It just was so exciting, there was so much energy in the air, and and working with them in the studio, listening to them play live, it was innovative, it was cutting edge. You know, people, was, especially big, I mean, I, I hadn't heard of anybody collaborating, you know, ballet and, and rap music, so I, I think these were some huge moments, and you know, that's sort of what kind of sets Atlanta Ballet apart, is, is it's always been about collaboration and, and trying to find something new that, that another ballet company hasn't done. I think um, the next chapter of my life is first and foremost being there for Lucas and being mom and um, enjoying that time with him because it's special and it's precious and I'm already seeing that you know one year has flown by already and I can't tell you where it's gone <laughs> and um, also for the future is I love to teach I, I have to be involved in some way I love dance too much and I've had so many experiences that I just need to pass it on. I need to, to tell people what I know. It's, it is amazing to think, you know, at 10 years old, I had this dream to be a ballerina and, and this desire, and I told my parents that's what I wanted to be, but it's so rare and it's so unique that it actually happens. And I know how special that is, and you know, I just, it's, it has been my dream, and, and it came true. It, it's, it's amazing. <laughs>